Last weekend, the Syrian Arab Army, SAA, and its allies continued their counter-attack at the al Sinaa district, industrial district, in the Deir Azor province's capital, striking ISIS militants to the east of this area. According to ground reports, the Syrian forces advanced at the al Sinaa district, capturing several buildings, including the welding and sewing factories. The clashes are continuing. The Syrian forces have continued offensive operations in the Deir Hafa plains in the Aleppo province. Since last Friday, the pro-government forces seized the villages of Jaruf, Tal al-Shabi and Umm Kawa and continued their advance towards al-Bab. Additionally, the SAA is advancing in the direction of the city of Deir Hafa. The Syrian Democratic Forces, SDF, which includes Syrian Kurds supported by separate Arab units, have been continuing military operations to capture the area of the Tishreen Dam, which links the Aleppo and al Raqqa provinces. By December 26, the SDF had captured the Tishreen Dam and continued its offensive operation in the direction of the Aleppo province. Separately, the SDF took control of several villages in the province, including al Waisi, located near the vast Euphrates River, a few kilometers from the Turkish border. The most likely aims of the SDF in East Aleppo are the ISIS stronghold of Menbej near the Turkish border and the Jerabulus border crossing. Thus, the US-backed forces are clearly threatening Ankara's interests in Syria. It could lead to a new phase of cooling of US-Turkish relations. Also, it provokes Turkey into additional military build-up and into increasing its support of terrorists on Syrian territory.